Hey everybody, it's Renee L.A. and today is all about boots. These boots are made for walking. Ha! All right, so you may say, well, uh, what month is this? Um, the snow has melted and you're talking about boots. And so I'm really not talking about snow boots. Um, as a matter of fact, I wouldn't even wear these boots in the snow. For me to wear these outside, there can't be any um, snow on the ground. And so uh, I got everything from Kohl's. And so I know for me, uh, Kohl's has been around for quite some time. K-O-H-L apostrophe S or K-O-H K-O-H-L-S.com, Kohl's.com. It's a department store. And um, for everything that I've purchased, I'll put the links, uh, I'll put the links in the, bo uh, in the bottom, in the comments. And so uh, if you're interested in getting those, if you like them, you can, uh, you know, get them. And so um, the reason why I was buying boots is because let's go all the way back to Black, I almost said Black Tuesday. Black Thursday, Black Friday, whatever day that is, right? Black Thursday. Well, it used to be Black Friday, that's right. And then they started doing it on Thursday, the actual day of Thanksgiving, which I just have no words for that. And I'm sorry to all the people who can't have a day off um, on Thanksgiving. Anyway, I never inter interrupt on that day. I always go out the next day. And so Kohl's is one of those stores. Um, they stay open. And uh, they always have, this is like the second year in a row where they've had um, boots. That's a great time for you to get boots. Now, for a very long time, when it came to boots, if they were not leather, I didn't mess with them. If they were not leather, I repeat, I did not mess with them. But then uh, I was going Black Friday shopping and I would see all of these good looking boots and that weren't leather. And so I said, okay, you know, let me try. And I got them. And so, you know, it's fine. Just know that they're not going to last forever. Like my leather boots, like my leather boots, I, like I keep stuff. And so I'll have a pair of boots for like 10, 15, sometimes 20 years, you know, if they're made out of leather and well made. But anyway, it all started with this. <laughs> These boots. Okay. And so you can see they're like some, you know, booties, you know, kind of short. See, I've worn them quite a bit. See the little tabs on the back? See that? Got the little V on the side. And so, you know, I thought these were cute. Um, I got them. And I got them from Colts. And so, um, you know, no big deal. You know, I, got, I already have one of those people. I have too much stuff anyway. And so I got these boots, you know, not even thinking about it. And then to my surprise, as I would get dressed for the day going to work, I would put on the boots. I would put on the boots. I would put on the boots. And because um, with the work that I do, I'm an educator. And for many years, especially in my younger years, I used to wear my heels. I used to wear heels to work. And all that. Now that I'm older and I have a different position, um, I can't wear heels because, you know, I do sometimes, but not really. And if so, I try to make them, you know, chunky heels. I can't be cute like that. And plus, old girl got some miles on her. And so I'm just not into, you know, wearing heels and stuff, you know, trying to look all sexy and stuff all the time like I did when I was younger. And so these boots are comfortable and they're fashionable. And I just, being that they're snake print, they just go with everything. I can just throw them on. Whoop. Throw them on. Have on my whole outfit. Snake print at the bottom. Just really cool. And, you know, being that the, the colors are so neutral. So, Kohl's, if you didn't know, they have this thing called Kohl's Cash. And what Kohl's Cash is, is that you make a purchase. And, like, say, for every $50 or $100 you spend, um, they'll give you $20 or $50 or whatever in Kohl's cash, which you can use to purchase things at a later date. Now, I used to always just go to sleep on my Kohl's cash and just, you know, let it go. But I learned to, like, put it in my phone and, you know, say, hey, you got to spend your Kohl's cash by this particular date. So um, I had just come back into town from a conference and I said, let me use my Kohl's cash. The coronavirus situation is going on. So I usually, because the best way to use your Kohl's cash 
is to go to the store. Go to the store. So then you don't have to pay for shipping or anything like that. You can just buy your stuff, Kohl's cash, walk right out. And then also you'll tend not to spend as much extra money. When you do it online, you spend more money than, you know, because maybe I may have had like $50 in Kohl's cash, but I ended up spending $75, I guess, or whatever, um, so that I could get the free shipping, you know, and I know that's all just a, a rope of dope, you know, sucker deal, but I just did it anyway, especially since I knew that my shopping was going to be nipped in the bud. So here it is. Here's my Kohl's box. I was like, I'll just go for it because, you know, the whole shopping and I have still been shopping online, but it's been for more practical stuff like bread flour. I'll do that later. <laughs> okay. So first, let me see what I got here. Yeah, and this SO or so, that's the same brand of these. All right. So, oh yeah, 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 this makes sense. It totally makes sense with the shirt that I have on. Ooh, look at that. Oh my, yes, I love these. Look at that, so cute. And so snake skin is cool, but Lord knows I'm a cheetah girl. <laughs> and so I love, you know, the leopard and or cheetah print. I love it so much. And I like these, these feel, you know, slightly, you know, velourish, slightly, you know, not furry, but you can feel the smooth kind of velour finish. And so that is, incredibly nice whereas these you know have more of a you know kind of pleather feel more of a pleather feel now I do oh I did mention that yeah normally for years I just for boots if they weren't leather I didn't mess with them um, I know um, people do have opinions when it comes to leather versus pleather um, for me leather causes me not to purchase as frequently so I know you know some people are like oh but pleather vegan pleather and all that stuff but with leather I don't purchase as frequently I'm still mad about this jacket that I love this red jacket and it was pleather and I wore it for years and then one year it just started fraying and everything just flaked off and I was so mad because for, like I said, I keep certain things for decades, and I could have kept that, but it was pleather. All right, so here's the second pair of these boots I made for walking. Thank you, Nancy Sinatra. Ooh, honey. Okay, I have to give a shout out to my girl. What's her name? What is her name? She's in New York. She's in Harlem. She got it going on. I know so much about her, but I can't. Steel, NYC. Why can I remember her name? Anyway, it was one of the first videos. I'm sure her name will come up before I, uh, it's done. But anyway, um, it was one of the first videos that I, I came upon, and she had white boots, and she was talking about uh, wearing them right in the middle of the winter time. I probably won't do that, but um, yeah, I, I just thought I said that's so dope. You know, white boots. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I said, I would just love that. And so I can't wait. You know, put this on with a pair of jeans. That would be so nice. You know, have whatever you got going on up top. And then, boom, you got your white boots sticking out from underneath. And once again, there's that So brand. I don't know the, the is it S-O or So, but I, I'll say So because I don't see a period after each um letter like it's an initial and this one also has memory foam inside so it'll be a little softer step so that'll be cool all right Let's see here okay it's gonna fight with me okay so let me put this back and then I think this is last but not least yes it is Last but not least, here is the third uh, pair of boots. Now, one thing that you don't know about me is in the summertime, I love a good cowboy hat. 
so I forgot to take them out. I'm gonna bring. I'm gonna show you my cowboy. All right, thanks. I had to go get my cowboy hats. So every summer I like to wear cowboy hats. Try to keep the sun out of my out of my face, and then just plus, I just look dope in my cowboy hat. Um, I'm not, you know, a country and western fan. Um, I don't do not listen to country music. I mean, I got a couple. You know, I think everybody has a couple maybe country songs that they may like. Um, but other than that. You know, like I know who Garth Brooks is, but I can't name any of his songs and things like that. So, um, and if I do like anybody, it's somebody real commercial like Shania Twain, you know, and her stuff really doesn't sound country. But, um, so it's not like, you know, I'm like Miss Country and Western, not at all. But my cowboy hat looks dope. This first one, and this is beat up all to hell, but I got it a long time ago. And I usually, when I wear it, I usually take all my hair back and let the rest just hang in the back. Something like that. And I um, got this from, like, Target. And, you know, I make sure, you know, I fix it and all that stuff. And I mold it to how I want it to be. And then I get out in the mean streets and I'm always getting compliments on this hat so this one it's been around for quite some time but I love uh, my cowboy hat but I've never had cowboy boots okay and so then here's my other cowboy hat bam now you can see this one you know is more structured um, this one I paid a lot more money from and I got it from uh, state fair so we go we have a huge state fair in my state and every year you know they sell cowboy hats and I do not get one every year but I keep my eye out for you know what grabs my attention and this one did this one particular year but I like this one a lot too and so I put my cowboy hat on and I do my thing and you see how it creates this ring you know it keeps the sun out of my eyes and out of my face so that's really cool so anyway Every summer, I bust out with my cowboy hat, and I'm always, you know, on the lookout during state fair for a different one. Okay, so here are the boots that I thought might be really cute if I put them on. Once again, that so brand. And like I said, these are, you know, pleather, um, polyurethane, or whatever they call them, PU, I'm assuming that stands for polyurethane. And these will be so cute with a pair of shorts not daisy dupes i'm too old for that and i have way too much cellulite on my thighs but um definitely some cute shorts in my cowboy hat look at these Ooh, look at that honey mm -mm -mm. yep look at that or in the fall as well you know and we'll see like when i say i say it's summer but probably like spring but look at these. Aren't these awesome? Man, these are awesome. These are awesome. And you know, like these, ooh, this is nice and soft and cushy inside. I won't be um, wearing these all the time. You know, I'm going to take my horse to the whole town road, you know. And so um, I won't be wearing these all the time. So it's okay. That they're pleather but I hope that if I really you know like them that uh, I will you know wear them often during the spring and if I can stand it to be this because I usually like my feet out in the summertime you know so maybe this will be a spring fall instead of summer maybe I misspoke thinking of summer but I was thinking of you know having a tank top my cowboy hat some shorts and my little boots because that might be cute too but anyway those are my shoes or boots that I got from Kohl's, um, spending my Kohl's cash. And so, like I said, I had about $50 maybe in Kohl's cash and then spent an extra $25. That's exactly what Kohl's wants you to do. But that's okay. I'm not mad at them. Um, I really enjoyed what I got. Oh, let me go over it uh, one more time. One more last review. Once again, my Western boots. Okay, I love them. Booties, I should say, because they're not full boots. 
you see the gradient, the ombre that you have, the gradient. It's like a tan and then it gets more of a dark tan, more of a rust. So these. Now remember, if you like them, I'll uh, link them down below. Coles, and I really hope, because some of these stores, like I hope Macy's makes it, I hope Coles makes it, you know, after all this coronavirus and the, the great depression recession that we're getting ready to have, I hope that they're able to make it through. So I say, if you want your favorite stores to open, buy some. <laughs> and so, um, but yeah, I shouldn't say that because a lot of people have lost their jobs and stuff. I'm sorry. Um, that's true. And, and hey, frankly speaking, I may be one of them as well. So, you know, we'll see. But I just said, I'm going to give it to Jesus, and I ain't going to worry about it for now. All right. And then the white booties with the memory foam. Oh, so dope, so fresh, and so clean. And last but not least, look at these. Cheetah girl. Cheetah girl. Okay. Whereas the other one kind of had like a black material from here to there this one does not no worries no worries so pretty mm. and remember this was all inspired by these little babies here and so um i am going to start my instagram soon i've been taking pictures but i never put any dude i was just taking pictures because i like my outfits and um I was just taking pictures and then I said, well, let me put them on Instagram because I know that um, if you didn't know very soon uh, and probably my next video will be that uh, I'll start doing thrift hauls because I am a thrifter. I love thrifting. I love fashion. And this particular shirt is one. I think it's a Land's End. Oh, it's a Land Land's End shirt that I got um, from the thrift and um usually shirts cost no more than five dollars 250 if it's a half price um sale and uh i love this one and uh so my next video should be a thrift video so that i can show you all of the fun things that i've gotten um thrifting and i've been taking just pictures of my outfits just because i like them just so i can just remember and just have fun and I just love it. And so uh, after I realized that I'm going to start doing thrift hauls, I noticed a lot of people that do do thrift hauls, they were like, oh, and check out my Instagram. So I'll be able to say the same thing. And what I noticed, I wear these boots a lot when I go to work. And I'm like, oh, there are the boots again. Oh, there are the boots again. Oh, what do I have on my feet? The boots again. You know, so just say if there are six pictures and at least four, I'm wearing those boots so so anyway I was so inspired by them so uh, if you like them the links are below and that's all I have to say for today so uh, best wishes to you and this is Renee LA over and out au revoir thank you merci